All right. Hello, my fellow Star Wars fans. Um, we need to talk about the Acolyte. All right, so episode five. Sorry I couldn't get my live stream to work tonight, but that will be next week, and I am super excited to do that. But so let's just talk about the Acolyte. Episode 5. The best and worst episode. Yes, I just got home. Yes, I watched it. But. My God. We need to talk. Alright. So it started off really well. Then the lightsabers. With, we actually got to see lightsabers kill people. About time in this show. Um, so, when that happened, let's. This show, it's like. I don't even know anymore. Like, how. Is it supposed to be good? Are they wanting it to be good? Like, honestly, I don't even know at this point anymore. I'm just super... Uh, really frustrated with this show. I really am frustrated with it. And... I don't know how that could be a possibility, but I just am. And I'm getting a little pissed off with it because I'm a huge Star Wars fan. I'm not gonna play dumb and say, oh, I'm a big Star Wars fan. I get all this cool stuff. I They fly me out to Lucasfilm headquarters. Like. You're not a fan. You're a paid shill. If you were a fan. You would not be defending this. God awful show. If you were a fan. You would be. Telling Lucasfilm. Write better stories. If you were a fan, you would know episode three is by far the worst f produced show ever made. If you were a fan, you would not let them get away with how bad they destroyed Anakin's Ark. I don't know how I'm gonna continue watching this show, but when I mean episode five is like the best and possibly the worst is because they do something. You, you see Smilo Wren headbutt hands like and then it's like a whole thing like at the end like you can't read my mind because of my helmet Like, I'm sorry, but what the heck were the writers thinking? Even Leslie Headland, gosh, Leslie, Harvey Weinstein's personal assistant, just is trying to defend this show. 
Which is kind of hard, because... You're trying to defend this show when you realize you're never going to be hired or work at Lucasfilm ever again. The Acolyte destroyed Star Wars for me. And I don't think there is ever a way I can ever be a Star Wars fan again. Come after me all you want. After seeing two episodes, now five, I saw the first two like a couple weeks ago when they at a Star Wars event. You. I really hope Skeleton Crew is good. Because if not, I am so sorry George Lucas made that deal with Disney. And after the shit they keep pulling with this, I'm not even excited for the Ray solo Star Wars movie anymore. I'm worried about Andor season two. Yeah. Disney should just pull the plug on the Acolyte right now. We don't need episode six, seven, eight. We don't need them anymore. Disney proved its point that they destroyed Star Wars. <sighs> All right. I was going to get into episode five, but the more I think about it, the more I get pissed off. <laughs>